Hey, hey, it's Starfish of Fire, and I'm back today with some spicy snacks. Alright, so I got these from Inferno Candy Company. You should check them out. They've got quite a variety of snacks, from sweet stuff to chips like these, and various other stuff too. They, they really do make some wonderful products, and I've done reviews of their stuff in the past. Today, I have two bags of chips. Okay, so we're going to start out with this one here called Carnage Maple Bacon Flavored Kettle Chips. Now I love their labels, like a gold colored bag and then you've got the, uh, the label on there. Now the ingredients are right there on the front, very simple. Potatoes, vegetable oil, Carolina Reaper, peppers, maple flavored bacon and salt. Alright, so they're kettle chips and I'm very interested in trying these. See what kind of heat level we got, what kind of flavor profile we're dealing with. Well, we know the flavor profile, I guess we want to see how good they taste. Alright, see what we're dealing with here. Get right into it. Yeah. Alright, so there's just a single layer. I smell bacon and maple. I do have a hint. Ooh. Now I smell the peppers. Okay. Let's have a go, shall we? Well, first of all, let's see what these look like. Alright. Wow. A lot of powder on these chips. When you see that, I have a feeling these are not going to be the kind of chips you sit around and watch a movie and just snack on. But let's find out. Carnage. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Now the thought. The first thing you taste, bacon maple, and here comes the heat. Yeah, there's a good amount of heat there when it's building. Carolina Reaper slowly builds. It's... Mm, wow. Okay. We get the sweetness of the maple, smokiness of the bacon. Wow. Mm. Okay, so the heat's still be building on these, but I'm going to say it like this. These are not going to be something that you're going to sit down and snack. These are extremely hot. My tongue is on fire right now. Entire tongue burn. Stuck in my teeth. Wow, seriously. Okay. Good flavor. It's actually a pleasant burn. Um, these hopefully will not go... I'll be able to keep them long enough to... Well, probably be handing them out to friends. But yeah, they are good. Great flavor. Ah. Hmm. Those are pushing this uh, challenge level, to be honest. Ugh. Woo! Yeah. Okay. Now, I feel like whatever I do with these, my tongue's already burned. Wow. Alright. We're going to try, though. Maybe let this simmer down. So, this is called Meltdown. Smoked sea salt and malt vinegar kettle chips. So, again, these are kettle chips. I like the label. It's got like a skull with a gas mask and there's green fumes coming out. Alright, ingredients. Potatoes, vegetable oil, Komodo dragon peppers. Now, I don't know. I haven't tried those yet. I have one of their cereals I'll be trying that has Komodo dragon. Um, from what I understand, this could be hotter than the Carolina Reaper. There are several peppers out there like the Pimatali and 
you know, the Pepper X and the Apollo, these kind of peppers that are hotter than the Carolina Reaper. However, I'm not sure about this one, I've heard. Uh, so, uh, Komodo Dragon Peppers, Malt Vinegar, Applewood Smoked Sea Salt, and Natural Flavors. So, Okay. Meltdown. Komodo Dragon, huh? Okay. Ugh. Ah. Ugh. Whew. Still reeling from that. Okay. I, I do like uh, when you got, well, this is a smoked sea salt and all vinegar. I just like salt and vinegar is one of my favorite chips. It's simple. Reminds me of Canada. If you've been up to Canada, instead of ketchup, they give you little bowls of vinegar to dip your fries in. You know what? It's pretty good. Yeah. I know you're American when you ask for ketchup. Or tomato sauce. A lot of vinegar, malt, apple wood smoked sea salt. You know. Okay, we're going to give this a go. These look darker. I'm just going to grab, ooh, that's a, what she said. Um, look at that. If you can see that that is just coated. It's dark, just coated with, I'm assuming, the Komodo Dragon pepper powder. All right, I think I've recovered enough. Let's give it a go. Meltdown. Mm. Great flavor. Okay. Mmm. Right. Great flavor. Ugh. The heat's rising. Wow. Okay. Mmm. Again, not necessarily snackable. Ooh, yes, there's the heat building up. Entire tongue again. Oh. Okay, so as far as heat goes, we'll start with this one. This one is definitely a five. This one might be pushing a six. It's hard to tell, but it's a hot one. Oh. Tire tongue burn, starting to, eyes starting to water, a little bit of snot building up. Ah. <coughs> oh, okay, good flavor, great chip, incredible heat. <coughs> this is a six. Oh, gotta figure it. Wash my hands. Okay. Oh, we taking these to work. I have a little fun. Whew. Oh. Now these aren't to the level where you couldn't use these as prank chips. Mix these in with some normal kettle chips at a party. You know. Ah. Sit back and watch the fun. Yeah, see, there goes the tears. That is an intense burn. Wow. My hands are tingling. That's endorphins. Wow. I think my tolerance is down. I haven't done the challenge in a while. And... <coughs> Devin at six. He's still building. Oh. Okay, well, 
Like I said, they've got plenty of products to choose from. Go to Inferno Candy Company um, and check out what they have. Like I said, they've got chocolate stuff and popcorn drizzled with chocolate and Carolina Reaper, these kind of things. Man, my time is on fire. Check them out. Great flavored chips. Eat moderation. Starfish of fire. And I'm out.